One of the ways in which SAP Business One can help you manage your business proactively instead of reactively is through user alerts. In this case, you can see a list of all the alerts that are built into the product. For example, items one through five are built into the product, as well as item number eight. So if you'd like to look at that list in detail, pause at this point and look at the list. Uh, due to the length of the recording, I want to continue otherwise. Then there's also the ability to create user-defined alerts. In this case, we can track alerts for transactions or invoices that are greater than $5,000 and 30 days past due, or other customers for which we've had no contact in 30 days. The one I'm going to examine is a predefined alert. It's called deviation from discount amount. In this case, you can see I'm going to actually send that to the manager. And I've set a parameter uh, of any discount greater than 20% will trigger an alert. And I can also determine which documents I would like to send alerts on. For example, I'm only monitoring large discounts on quotations. Once I've set up the alert, and if I were to go in, for example, a customer service session, you can see that my customer service person is going to create a quotation for her customer and we're going to add a couple of items here and if you remember our parameter was 20 percent so in this case I'm going to enter a 22 percent discount perhaps they enter it uh, fat finger it it's supposed to be a 2 percent discount respond back with a 22 percent discount add the transaction and because we've set up the alert with with an SAP Business One, if I go back into the Sales Manager session, you will see real time that it receives notification of the large discount. And there's the large discount. He's obviously concerned, so he's going to do a right mouse click. He can view the gross profit, and everything is showing up in red. So, as part of his daily chores, he's going to reply back to Sophie, and we're going to continue it with internal, but note you could also have sent it to external email as well and if he wants he can actually have some predefined responses so discount is too high and maybe add some verbiage call to discuss and he sends it off and now the customer service person will receive notification that there's a message for her she can drill back she views the quotation notices the large discount and she updates it at this point and now if you look at the gross profit we'll see that everything is showing up in black indicating again a positive gross profit so alerts they will help you manage your business proactively instead of reactively so you can monitor things that are important to you and there's six predefined alerts within business one in addition to that you can create alerts that will allow you to monitor things that are important to you. In the example we saw here and that list was, for example, give me a list of all invoices greater than $5,000, greater than 30 days past due, so it would help with your collections. I encourage you to also monitor the other video on approval procedures within Business One. The difference there, like the name implies, transactions will actually receive approval prior to going to the next stage. Thank you for attending my session.